All right, so targets acquired. See them? All right, they're right here. Now, as soon as this wave goes by and another big wave comes, we're gonna pounce on them. All right, get ready. Here they come. Here they are. What's up everybody, Blue Gabe? I'm on the beach and I'm catching something that ain't none of y'all gonna expect me to cook, but I'm gonna cook them. I'm gonna swap this camera around, point it in that direction and show y'all. You're gonna be wondering what you're looking at, but you're looking for two little veins. It almost looks like a seashell as the wave goes out. All right, get ready. See all these little ripples right here? That's what we're after. You guessed it, we're after sand fleas. We're doing a sand flea catch, clean, and cook, except for I don't have anybody to film, so it's gonna be hard to show you, but I've got my GoPro, I've got this camera. I'll do it long enough until I get the right amount of footage, then we're headed back to the house to cook. These are sand fleas. Now they're not very big, but right now that's all we got to work with. Sand fleas. These jokers bury under the sand so fast. All right, so I'm gonna bust out the GoPro and try to show you a little bit more footage of how we catch them and what they look like. All right, y'all, so I found a contestant since I don't have a camera guy. He's gonna show you all how to scoop them one time. And on top of that, I'll show you too, but with him doing it, I can show you the full detail. All right, here it goes. All right, you always gotta wait for the wave to come in a little bit. All right, that's it. it. That's how it's done. Yes, sir. Now, now we're gonna go home and cook them. <laughs> <laughs> I'll catch a five pound pompano like I did last year. Oh yeah. <laughs> oh, I see some big ones right there. All right, so once you get the, all the dirt in there with this fleas, you gotta get it in the water and shake it out. Only a couple keepers, but hey, I got enough for a snack now. All right, I'm gonna go for another scoop. So they're running small, they're not very big, but guess what? They're gonna taste exactly like sand fleas. And that's what we're after. Y'all look in this bucket. Look in there. Oh yeah. We're cooking them bad boys tonight. All right, so these are sand fleas. This is what we grew up catching as kids. I don't normally catch them with a basket, but right now with no cameraman, I can't possibly do it the way I do. I just jump in there and scoop them up with my bare hands. But these sand fleas are also really good bait, so we're gonna catch a bunch to cook and a bunch to also cook, yet freeze and put up for pompano bait in the winter. And y'all will see that in a later show. So I hope you're enjoying this video. It's a beautiful ocean. It's a beautiful day. Most importantly, it's an awesome day to be alive. Let me go down here and show you real quick what they look like. See, watch, watch my hand. Oh, there went one. See them? They live in the sand. Oh, there went one. So most of the time I would just jump in, use both hands as a big shovel and scoop them out. Oh, I got one. There you go. Yeah. 
So their shells are super hard. When you cook them, they go from hard to crunchy. So I'm gonna catch a bunch, fill this bucket up, let y'all enjoy the show, the waves. We're headed back to the house. All right, y'all, I just met a lady named Allison. Look at this fish she just caught. Pretty dope. What is it exactly? It's called a glass nose whiting or a bubble nose whiting. Technical species name, Atlantic Threadfin, but they come through here in schools periodically. They're never here very long. I've lived here my whole entire life and have never seen one, if that tells you all anything. But she's here pumping out fishing with sand flea. She's actually got her own sand flea catcher. I'm gonna let her show y'all the rig that she uses. All right, so show us what you're working with. This one is a, a standard tackle store rig. You can usually get two hooks or three hooks. Some people use um, like an offset kale hook, pompano hook, and some people use a circle hook. And then people use different kinds of floats to keep their baits up. So sometimes I use the fish bites. Dang, that's a big one. Sand flea, yep. Sometimes I use shrimp. Interesting sand flea fact. Y'all, she's the real deal. I've been sitting here chatting with her for five minutes. I think she's more knowledgeable than most men that I've ever met. She's just a chick down here fishing on the beach, enjoying herself. Tell everybody what your, tell everybody what your social media is. It's Real Love Florida, R-E-E-L. Awesome, now is this the first time you've ever beach fished? No. <laughs> All right, I wanna show y'all one last time just how quick these things disappear when you turn them loose. Now, a lot of these are super small, I get it. But hey, you get the point. Just like that, they're gone. All right, y'all, so we came, we caught, we watched her catch, but now we gotta go home and cook. All right, well, hey, I was gonna go do a lobster video. Ocean's rough, got big storms blowing in over my shoulder. Came here, did a sand flea show. Now we're gonna go home. I'm thinking I'm gonna put them in a walk flash fry them, little Thai chili. Look, she got a bite. Look at her. This lady's a trooper. All right, well, I can't sit here and film forever, so I'll see y'all in the kitchen. Don't go anywhere, because I'm telling you, I've got something in my mind I'm going to do to these sand fleas, and it's going to be good. We'll see y'all at the house. All right, y'all, we're back at the house. Before we start the sand fleas, let me show you what we're working with in my brand new Trucker Grill. So we got chicken on the bottom, jalapeno poppers on the middle, corn on the top. Look at that! Bam! And we got a bunch of heathens in the pool. We got Samuel and Jake and Ella and Luke. Now let's take it to the kitchen. Look at that, look at that! All the little sand fleas you want to eat. Look at these, I got two contestants right here that are so, not her. Her and her, Bree's the most excited. She loves crunchy things. We got Stephanie over here hiding out. We got Mark behind the camera and look at these beautiful sand fleas. See all the little orange things? That's what the woman in the video was talking about row. Let me get one to where you can see. Yeah. So we got some fresh garlic chopped up, some onions, some peppers, and some jalapenos. There we go. Oh yeah, look at that. God, can you smell that? So we have no idea what we're working with here other than sand fleas and what we have in this pan. We don't know how to cook them. We have never cooked them, but we're gonna try to cook them. And we got ready to test them, in case they're bad. Since she didn't like, all y'all that watched the iguana video, Lacey liked it, Bree didn't. All right, you didn't like it. You did like it? Well, you were the one saying you didn't like it. We all liked it, actually, you guys. Thanks for all y'all watching that video. It hit a million views in less than seven days. So thank you for that. All right, I think we had them. Look at this. Let's put them in here. Guys, it's your last swim. All right, put it over here so they can smell it. Can y'all smell that? Mmm. Look at that. Looks so good. I'm almost glad they're not big. <laughs> if 
If they're not good, we don't have to taste them much. I just went and purchased this wok today. All right, I think they've been on there long enough. Just try to drain off some of the grease. I mean, people eat grasshoppers and stuff. It's gotta be better than that. All right, just for a little added bonus, a little can cooker Creole. Sort of like putting salt on popcorn. Now let's let them cool off and we're gonna enjoy. Come on, Chef Mark, show us what we're working here. It's amazing. Y'all, we just put this Traeger grill together today. You wish you could try some of it right now? I'm gonna try a bunch of it in a minute. What kind of chicken that'll change your life? Wi-Fi technology, jalapeno poker, some corn. Getting it in, folks. Getting it in. Huh. What, are you trying to be a backup cameraman right now? I already fixed it. There we go. All right, I'm gonna go in the house and set some plates. The food though. Big shout out to Mark for helping me put the new Traeger grill together. Samuel, well, he didn't do very much. <laughs> Stephanie helped me cook. Lacey, Bree. Can I help you eat? You... <laughs> That's right. <laughs> All right, Mark, ask the blessing. Dear Heavenly Father, we thank you for this day. We thank you for this time. We ask you to bless this food and just see that it nourishes our bodies. And we ask you to forgive us our sins and help us to be better in Jesus' name. Amen. 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 I say we take one and cheers. Oh, yeah. Come on. Oh, everybody. Y'all act like y'all are eating yeah. something crazy here. The legs. Bree, just. All right. All right. Come on, Bree. Ready? One, two, three. Oh, go. Mm, it's pretty, pretty darn good. good. It's very good. I can't get it down. It's good. <laughs> you chew it and swallow What happened? It's crunching. <laughs> it's crunching. <laughs> Good man, it tastes just like soft shell crab. I'm yeah. telling you. Yeah. All right, Samuel, take some oh, several heaping bites to give us your honest opinion. Not of the meat, oh. of the of the sand uh, place. I'm good. Mark, I'll pass. I'll pass. I'll try. I'll pass. You don't like them? Here, get a pepper. All right, they're good. Come it's on, like Lace. They're really good. It's like soft shell crab. There's my trooper. Seasoning. Mm. I mean, they are really good. I don't know what the big deal is. My partner in crime over there, she's like... Oh, the texture. Mm. That texture was awful. Thank Thank you. Tastes what? identical to soft shell crab. Identical to soft shell crab. I'm gonna get the big one. What you think? Why the serious face? <laughs> I'll make this face of a, of a, of a sad speak. <laughs> <laughs> the little ones taste like tender and buttery, but the big ones taste like like sea, like more seaish. Seaish? Yeah. Sea what you think, Ella? Are you going for it? He's going for it. Put it in there and chew it up. Yummy, right? Mm. That's the crunch. He's like, no. What do you think? Tastes like shrimp. Mm. Was it good? It's like crab. Is it that happy dance All right, well. Doggy. See, Luke is a champ. Yeah. When he tries something, he's going to say yeah. it's good, but then he'll just say, no, thank you. I don't need any more. Yeah. I tried it. Is he eating another one? No. Oh, no that's one. corn. All right, Luke, thanks for trying it. See, Lukey, Lukey, I said thanks for trying it. Thanks for trying it. <laughs> no, you're supposed to say, you're welcome, Dad. <laughs> All right, before I forget, check out the new Blue Gabe merch. Oh, perfect. Turn that one around. Look at that. Bam, different colors, sailfish, different prints. Thanks, Steph. Now we can get back to the exit. Look at Sand fleas. Yeah, sand Gotta fleas. Gotta love it. Bree's not scared. She's trying to get a piece of that chicken in her mouth so she doesn't have to taste it. <laughs> She's like, yes. I need something to drink. Is that better? Way better. <laughs> butter. Now I got good. butter right there on this thing. Perfect. Now they taste good. Let's try that. Lay, so you liked them? Trigger chicken. Mmm. Like Mom, can you pass me the That's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about. That trigger chicken. I'm going to eat the rest of that bowl of sand fleas. All right, y'all. Thanks for watching. Thanks for subscribing. I hope you like that sand fleas. Big thumbs up. Thanks for all the likes. Thanks for all the positive vibes. Let me walk in here real quick and show you the heathens. This video was a little bit harder to cook, so 
I had to keep the kids in the game room. For those of y'all that follow me and support me, here's what I deal with on a daily basis. Look at the chaos. Big bucks that y'all haven't seen yet. Even my big Georgia deer on the other side of her. But like I always say, all good stories gotta have an ending. And right now this story is done, finished, finite. We out of here. Thank you for watching. See ya.